What up? What up, guys? How's it going? Hey, <laughs> Dan here, and welcome to an extremely exciting stream slash video, depending on when you're watching this. Today is the day where we finish Season 2 of Minecraft Story Mode, potentially the last Story Mode episode ever, which is absolutely insane. I'm excited. I hope you guys are excited too. I know loads of you have been tweeting me, asking me when I'm streaming. When do we find out what happens? Well, it's now. It's right here. It's right now. And we're ready to go. I'm excited. Are you excited? Hey guys, I see you in the chat there. If you're watching uh, on YouTube after the fact, then how's it going? I hope you're going to have a good time. I think we should just hop straight into this. And start reading out stuff like the uh, the episode description, just so that people can start coming into the stream. But um, here we go, above and beyond episode five. Before in Minecraft Story Mode season one, there were I believe eight episodes. This one's only going to give us a good old five, unless they introduce some more later down the line. But we'll find out more in the story. The final battle. Okay, it says final battle, so I guess not. <laughs> the final battle with Jesse's new enemy brings the battle home to Beacon Town and the world may never be the same. It is going to be insane. I'm going to hit this button and we're going to start the last episode in three, in two, in one. Let's do this. Here we go. I'm so excited. We're going to get a recap because I can't really remember what happened. It's been a while. Let's do this. Previously I'm hyped. On Minecraft story mode. Here we go. <laughs> ah! It's going to happen. It's going to happen. There is a key difference between a good friend and a bad one. Yep. Good friends do what you ask. They okay. enjoy what you make for them. They never betray you. Wow. Not sure I betrayed Jesse you. Jesse is a perfect example of what we call a bad friend. Other what? bad friends include, in no particular order, Fred and Zara. <laughs> Ultimately, all losers who refuse to appreciate the gifts they've been given. Dude. Me, I won't stand for ingratitude. So I took my gifts away. Oh, but then, then, just when I thought I'd found a promising new friend... Oh yeah. Such a disappointment. That is when I had a brilliant idea. The perfect way to weed out the bad friends from the good. To be appreciated. I became Jesse. Ooh. That was right, of course. The plan worked immediately. Jesse's good friends flocked to me. A the better Jesse. <laughs> the better version? What? <laughs> <laughs> and now Jesse is trapped underground forever. One more ungrateful loser buried away. Oh yeah, you for the ninja. That was hilarious. That was one of my favorite bits the ever. The part of all really is that Jesse will never get to see how much better I've made Beacon Town. <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> oh yeah, we went through the portal to the under, the underneath, I think it was called. That was pretty awesome. And it adapts to the choices we make. So depending on what we did, it all comes down to this. I'm nervous, I'm afraid, but I'm ready. Here we go. What is that? <laughs> oh, it's Beacon Town. Dude, he's changed Beacon Town a lot, hasn't he? But we're underground. Not underground, actually. We're even further. Okay, we made it out. We are underground. <laughs> to fortify these tunnels into town. Oh. Oh, no. Speaking of fighting admins, I can't help but wish we still had Zara around. I know she was... Well, she was a little much. But having an ex-admin on our side seems like it could have come in handy. I guess. She's still scared. Um... I can't remember what Zara did, which is really annoying. I think Zara's already done plenty in the fight against Romeo. And... She's been at it a lot longer than we have. She deserves a break. Did she just yeah, go? That's fair. Uh, maybe Zara's lucky being where she is right now. She's not currently marching towards a fight with the admin. Maybe it's for the best that Vinta and the Fred Towners didn't make it out of the underneath. Oh, but yeah. They really to get above the bedrock just to have the admin, uh, you know. We saved yeah. him. 
Jesse, when Romeo finds out what we're trying to do, we've seen what he does. I don't want to end up like Fred. I don't want Beacon Town to be like Zara's town. We've seen so many terrible things that Romeo's done. I just can't even handle thinking about that happening to the others. To our home. Yes, things look impossible, and they might be. But I believe in all of us. Look how far we've come. Look at all the impossible we've already done. Exactly. We can do this. I know it seems hopeless, but we can't give up now. There are people up there counting on us, but we are not going to let them down. Hear me? You hear me? Yeah, I hear you. Let's do it. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do the thing. <laughs> <laughs> I like how she's wearing her admin clothes still. That's really cool. I like that. I want admin clothes, but not with the admin actually in them. I just want to steal his clothes, pretty much. Or have, like, special Jesse admin clothes. Oh, we've already got an achievement into the ruins. Starting strong, guys. Starting strong. No. So, oh, oh, I was going to say something then, but things have got real aggressive. Oh, <laughs> he's like, no, season two. No. Why season two? Why the end? Oh, dude, look at those admin iron golems. Those are cool. They're really cool. And they got like the Jesse thing going on as well. The evil Jesse. Oh no. Please leave the pigs alone. Oh. What? He made them kill the pigs? Why? Why? We haven't actually had much dealing with evil Jesse yet. I'm quite looking forward to seeing what the others have thought of evil Jesse. Whether they've worked it out or not. Looks like he's been pretty busy building though. But I am glad they kept the cow balloon. What do you that's the best. Bet that's where the primary terminal is. The giant yeah. floating tower with no clear entrance? Yeah, probably. We've got to find a way up there. Might be a good idea to hit the map shop. Regroup, get some supplies. Yeah, the map shop. yeah that sounds good. The map shop? Just go to a map shop. Look at all these banners, by the way. They're insane. They've like got tons of Jesse faces on them. I'm also not quite sure what I'm supposed to be doing here. Oh! Guys, admin. And he's with Axel and Olivia. We gotta hide. What? what? Where did they come from? Axel and Olivia, I haven't seen them for so long. Typical. Heading exactly where we wanted to go. Then I guess we just can't get caught. Yep. Why Admin exactly pig, that would be cool. Are we having a whole festival devoted solely to you? Do we really have to go up on stage with you in front of everyone? Enough. You two are going to need to do a lot less talking and a lot more agreeing if you want to be a part of Beacon Town. Not so sure I do, actually. In fact, we were just about to head home. I'd be very careful if I were you guys, or there might not be a home to go back to at all. Wow. It's just so easy for something bad to happen to a town. Like Champion City, for example. And boom! Oh my goodness. That actually made me jump. Did he just blow it up? I thought he was I thought he was joking. <laughs> he just blew up a city. Okay, yeah, he definitely just Boom! Wow. My no. Yep. I kinda didn't like you anyway, but that's fine. Yo, this guy's evil. So they are tricked. The old friends are tricked by the new Jesse. No, I'm not so sure. Yeah. Champion City. He blew it up. Yeah, he's a monster through and through. And he needs to be put down. Ugh. Yeah, I... I guess you're right. Now, how about you run along? And get that fireworks show ready for the big keynote, eh? Fireworks? Yes, admin. Uh, Jesse. Wait. She literally just said admin straight to his face. So maybe they do know that he's evil. I'm not sure. The admin's distracted. That's yeah, weird. We should grab Axel and Olivia while we have the chance. What? You were always so worried oh. about Champion oh. City, and now get him. One less thing to worry. Get him quick. Psst. Psst. Olivia, Psst. Axel. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. I knew it. I just knew it. Uh, whoa, am 
I seeing double? Run. Get out of that. Jesse, I... What is... Come on, I'll explain everything. But we have to get off the streets. To the map shop. Quick. That's insane that he just clapped and exploded the whole thing. That was pretty cool. I like that. <laughs> I mean, that was evil. That wasn't cool at all. I don't know what to say. Admins? A world beneath the bedrock? Yeah, you missed the whole series. I, made that part up. I mean, I'm relieved that the Jesse out there isn't the real you, but... But nobody else knows that. What if everyone in Beacon Town turns on you? Uh, I mean, with what just happened outside, Axel and I almost did. Look, the admin is good, but he's not good enough to have everyone fooled, right? It's a pretty good Jesse impression. I mean, a totally evil version, but yeah. <laughs> but you said there's a way to stop this guy, right? Petra. Are they being weird Poor still? Stella may be working for the admin and all. Nobody deserves that. Her whole city gone. Um, In an instant. Add it to the list of horrible things the admin's gonna pay for. Yeah, let's mess him up. Oh, that's cute. Weird that the so those two haven't been around okay. for the whole season though. <laughs> I'm glad they're back. Did Jesse tell you about the potato yet? The oh! In the underneath, we got our hands on something called a word of passage. Hashtag potato 451. I forgot about that. I know it sounds weird, but it's supposed to take away the admin's powers for good. <laughs> <sighs> That'll be payback for what he's done to our poor shop. <sighs> <sighs> Come on, hopefully it's not a complete wash. Is it even safe to hide out in here? <laughs> Yeah, it used to be the safest place around. It's safer than being out in the open. Yeah. True. Yeah, I guess that's true. Getting into that tower won't be easy. Hopefully, there's still something useful in here. Everyone, take a look around. Shout if you find anything. While you guys do that, I'm gonna keep watch. Nice. Okay, here we go. So, um, guys, just a quick note. If you're late to the stream, if you're watching live, you can go backwards to watch from the beginning. Just a heads up. Speaking of heads up, let's look at the heads here. See what I did there? <laughs> Surprised nobody wanted to take these. Too bad they don't help us, though. I like the ghast one. That's very cool. Very cool indeed. Radar, what's up, buddy? So we actually left, uh, we had the choice to leave Radar or to save people last time. And we left them there and saved Radar, which was a big thing. I wonder if it helps in the end. Or doing, hinders. Buddy? Just thinking about the people back in Fred's keep. That's who he's talking about. I mean, I'm happy to be here. Really. Just uh, let me know if you find anything, okay? Roger that. Roger that. Okay, uh, let's go to Jack. You okay there, Jack? Uh, fine, I guess. Just feeling a little violated at someone coming in here and robbing the place. Priceless artifacts and mementos gone. Everything ransacked. I don't know if it was the admin, looters, what I... Uh. I think we've all lost stuff at this point, Jack. But we're all in this together. We're gonna fight back. Yeah. Yeah. You're totally right. In the meantime, we'll keep looking around. Might be something useful in here yet. Uh, thanks, Jesse. I appreciate it. So are we looking for, like, an updated map? I'm guessing so, because this was the shop all the way in, like, episode one of series two. Uh, there's a lever. Should we pull this? Let's do it. Always pull a lever, guys. Always. Hey. Oh, Elytra. Hey, Jack. By the tides, I'd almost forgotten about that stash. Are these <laughs> Elytra wings? Those are super rare. Yeah. Got them one time when I made a trip to the end. Nothing better for gliding. What was that? Yeah. Did you hear that? Sound like a robot. 
I got the elytra, elytra, whatever you call them as well. Wings. Let's just call them wings. Why? Uh, guys? Why are you making me go? All by myself. Huh? <laughs> Let's go. I think it's going to be one of them iron golems. Maybe? What is it? Hey! Luna, you made it! <laughs> I never doubted it! Yes! Well, I guess I deserve that. Look at the hat as well. Beautiful. But so how did you get out of that prison? Yeah. Because I broke them out. <laughs> Ivor, what on earth were you just doing? Hanging out up there? Jesse, I'm a ninja. Where else would I be? <laughs> that is a nice outfit, Ivor. So random. Thank you! Oh, oh my oh my gosh. Do you know who that is? That is Ivor, founding freaking member of the Order of the Freaking Stone. <laughs> that is a legend, standing in front of us, Nurm, within arm's reach. Hey, you're pretty legendary yourself, Jack. Just play it cool around him. Right, right, cool. Cool. I, I, I can do cool. <laughs> Why did that change the story? Ivor, right? Sup? Yes, <laughs> I am Ivor. And you are... They call me the the Stab Walker. Yeah, that's a nickname. Yes. <laughs> Hi. Hello, strange stab person. Anyway, I am happy to report that your plan for the admin worked perfectly. You fell for my deception hook, line, and sinker. Story about you rotting away in prison forever? Big success. And after the admin's appetite for Jesse's destruction was satisfied, I returned to the prison by cover of night to free your friend from that cursed place. Nice. I was surprised, but this animal is quite the escape artist. I may consider naming her my apprentice. I'm so sorry that you had to be left behind. It must have been terrible. Now that the team is back together, Ivor, we need to stop the admin. We're supposed to use our word of passage at the primary terminal. Jesse thinks it's up in the tower. Yes. I believe that's exactly where it is. I've heard him reference such a thing several times. No one thinks to check for eavesdropping ninjas. <laughs> Let me guess. There's guards, right? Yes, yes. Though I requested a post there, the admin appointed special golems to patrol the place. Okay. Just, uh... You sure we can't, like reason with this admin guy you know, I'm talking out ready you wanting to talk it out Jesse taught me to keep the explosions in boomtown true You're kidding right after everything I've told you about him you still think we could just talk to him I don't know I just I just uh, look you know you taught me how to talk about things more I don't know his well, voice is way different. more reasonable than the admin Axel I'm pretty sure Axel is his voice I'm is completely different. A plan. We just need a distraction. Maybe a distraction like Jesse's big speech at the start of JesseCon. JesseCon. <laughs> that sounds great, but elytra wings don't exactly go up. <laughs> they do with fireworks. What's his no, plan? Think you could get me a map of Beacon Town? Hmm. <laughs> He's like, of course. There it is. Wow. Here's the plan. Like Jack said, we need fireworks. Which the admin has stockpiled backstage at the event. Wait, isn't Stella in charge of fireworks for this thing? Perfect. We'll never get backstage without fireworks guild uniforms. So we find Stella. She shows us where they are. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, this is actually us. Grab them. Thank you. Suit up and boom. Backstage passes. <laughs> this is great. There, we swipe some fireworks. I thought this was like just a montage of what they could do. I didn't realize we we're actually go doing it. With you guys? You're gonna be getting me a bucket of water. We'll get to that. While we're getting the fireworks, Axel and Olivia will distract the admin. Oh, maybe they are. Are you sure I can't just blow up the stage? Uh, that would be distracting. Axel? Then we wait until the big fireworks finale. The what? It's Romeo. I promise you, there will be a huge fireworks finale. <laughs> Petra and Jack will wait in the order hall. 
second those fireworks go off. Hey, let's go. That's awesome. I use the bucket of water to create a waterfall. Look, what's up? My bucket, your secret weapon. The three of us will head into the tower and use hashtag potato four five one to strip the admin of his powers before he even knows. Simple, right? Easy. That, uh, might just be the best crazy I've heard in a while. Jesse, this could work. Explosions, excitement, explosions. I love it. <laughs> this all starts with getting Stella to help us, though. Yeah. Yeah, she's pretty tight with that admin guy. Are you sure about that? She did seem kind of awful. Champion City was torn down. We all saw it. Stella's been hurt by the admin, too. There has to be a way to get through to her. Yeah, I wouldn't bet on that. Well, Stella does know where the Fireworks Guild uniforms are. I could follow her to them, and then we wouldn't have to talk. True. Wait, can I say how much I don't like this plan? You can, because you're staying here. Only Jesse stands a chance on the streets, because Jesse is... The admin! Yeah, that's right. Jesse! Your clothes! You gotta change. Okay, let's do it. Boom. <laughs> Jesse, <laughs> I know you think Stella's just another victim of the admin, but be careful, okay? I think Jesse should be more worried about the admin showing up during this plan. Good luck, friend. One serving of admin coming up. I can do this. I think we've got this. So he composes us, but we can also pose as him, which is quite cool. Here we go. I, I think we should keep the posters, though. If we do save the day, we should definitely just save them because they're cool. Time to find Stella. Let's go. So before we were, um, we were acting out the scenario. We still need to do that. Uh, let's look at the booth. I mean, why not? It's got my face all over it, so that sounds pretty cool. Uh -huh. This place just keeps getting weirder and weirder. <laughs> I do like the golems a lot. Where would Stella be? Because we need these uniforms. The uniforms look amazing. And, oh, wait a second. There. There she is. Wait, what? What the? Why is there two? Which one should I choose? Um, talk to guards. Follow Stella. But which way? This way? I'm going to go this way. Let's just see what happens. Because I'm the admin. I could do what I want, boy. Do whatever I want. Oh, your greatness. I searched everywhere for you. Uh, stop there. <clears throat> I present to you the newest Jesse Khan volunteers. They await your orders. Not the brightest quartet in the bunch, but... Uh... You know what? Let them take the day off. Go slime diving or something. Uh, uh, yes. Yes! Your leader is giving you a request. I want to see dives so beautiful the people will weep. <laughs> That's funny. So the reason I did that is so that we have less guards to worry about, basically. Now go dive in slime, punks. Oh, there they go. That's uh, not quite what I had in mind, but it's fine. It's fine. Oh. Forgot that he could teleport. Need the different eyes as well. That would be handy. What? What is happening? <laughs> I leave for even a moment. Pandemonium ensues. Stop doing that and get back to your posts. Oh, don't look at me like that. You know what you did. Look at the people in the background. They're so shook. <laughs> okay, so he just pops in whenever he wants to. I better find Stella fast before the admin finds me. Yeah, that's gonna be um, that's gonna make things pretty difficult because we won't be able to see him coming. And if there's two admins in the same place, there's only one of them that has red eyes, so we're gonna be in big, big trouble. Uh, our slot poster? Why would I want to look at that? I'm gonna go and look at it anyway. Oh, like everyone's scared of me. A lot. What is that for? Boy, it can't be to do like the ocelots from ages ago, could it? That's like that's like season one, episode one nonsense right there. 
Stella, is this you? That's that's not Stella. Stella. Wait. Uh, no, Lawrence. Lawrence. <laughs> I mean, you can totally call me Stella, though. <laughs> I'm actually looking for Stella. Blonde hair, looks kind of well, like you, but but not. Have you seen her? Uh, no clue, bro. Uh, maybe try the order hall. All the big wig bros hang there doing their big wig bro business, telling us all what to do. Okay. It's so weird. <laughs> Lawrence and Stella, a match made in heaven. That might be her. She's hanging out near the llamas. We stole her llama, so she's probably not too um not too fond of us. Why is she running away? Come back, <laughs> please come back, Stella. I don't like you, and now you're being even more annoying. Let's just go. Beacon Town looks pretty crazy, though. It hasn't actually changed that much apart from the big statue at the back, and it's kind of just a little bit blown up, but it's a lot less blown up than Champions Town. <laughs> Jesse, dude, just unveiled the new statue you built. Oh, yeah. It's Was got, that me? Um, character. Yeah, I kind of liked the old one, but. Whoa! Hey, I mean, you know what? This one is. Oh, totally can I get rad. him to change it back to what I built? <laughs> You know what? I change my mind. Let's bring the old one back, shall we? Dude! I can't wait to see it again. Not that, you know, this one wasn't... Like, go with your gut, dude. Especially if it wants the old one back. Yeah. Let's do it. Here we go. I can't even remember what I built. And it said my story is changing. Is that it? Right is that what I built? Thanks, Jesse, dude. Uh... Oh. That's unfortunate. Quick, go, run! Run! Get out of here. Get out of here, quick! He's gonna make us change it back, though. What? Nope, you didn't see me. See ya. Don't say a word, please. Don't say what? a thing. Wh where, where is my statue? You there, Nelly? What happened to my statue? <laughs> She's so scared. He's angry, the, though. The one you just tore down because your gut told you to. What? What are you talking about? What is she talking about? Like two seconds ago, you you, you were. You want to blame your insolence on me, Golems? Take oh no, her no, away. no 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 no! I didn't whoa, mean to do that. Whoa, whoa. Calm yourself, dude. Like, take some deep breaths, okay? <sighs> okay, we need to be careful, guys. Uh. No. No. Whoops. If I change too many things, he's gonna get even angrier and more suspicious. So I need to stop changing things. That's definitely Stella. Let's go. <laughs> Before I get myself in more trouble and get other people in more trouble. I, I can't believe I built that terrible statue, though. It's awful. Uh, I'm going to look at the beacon real quick because it's quite cool. I didn't mean to get um, Nelly taken away. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I feel really bad now. She got blamed for everything that I just did. I took down the whole statue. Look at this thing. Jessicon in action. I mean, Jessicon would be pretty cool, to be fair. And can you stop running away from me, please? Oh, no. Yep. If we get caught, we are so done. More fireworks and banners. We need to not get caught. Hire more people. Force them, conscript them, I don't care. Jesse Khan will be the greatest thing this town has ever seen. We need to be so careful, guys. Ensure you pay the price. Huh? Where the heck am I supposed to get more people? I know. But those outfits. Bingo. That's our ticket. I need it. I need those Mario outfits. Take them all. Take all of them. Perfect. Thank now you. Can... Oh, gravel. Where are those extra Jesse banners? Oh! Yeah, <laughs> awkward. Stella. Jesse, back so soon. <laughs> this is so awkward. Since when do you? Hmm, you're not the admin, are you? Oh. Hmm? Uh, I don't know. Dot dot dot. You can guess. <laughs> Knew it. Dang, she she knew. Keep your voice down, all right? Huh, that is bold. I'll give you that. 
coming back when the admin can just blah you into oblivion? Okay, give me one reason I shouldn't just hand you over to him right now. What? Don't After be like that. everything you've done to me. You can be a hero for once. You heard me. You have a chance to do good. To fight for a cause you know is right. Come on. Oh, look who's talking. You could have supported me as a friend, and instead, you rejected me. I can't wait until the admin delivers what you deserve. She is so weird. Nice like, seeing you too, Stella. I still don't like her. Stella's a punk. I'm taking these things. Thank you. Why is she so mad all the time? He literally blew up her city. I just stole a few things. And Jesse is now flying around. Okay. <laughs> He's cringing. It's like a try not to cringe challenge. I've got my best friends, Olivia and Axel, with me, don't I? Oh, at least they're in on it now. That's helpful. Who are you? Yes. Thanks, Jesse. We love being your best friend. Don't we, Axel? Oh, yeah. Totally. It's weird seeing his um his voice change. Oh, man, are your sleeves really tight? My sleeves like feel like they're cutting off my circulation. Yeah. This is chafing me in all the wrong places. Look, Gross. Remind me to never ask what the right places are. Hey, before we go back there. If things get hot, I want you to know that I've got your back. Thanks, buddy. Just like in prison. <laughs> I can and will fight anyone who tries to mess with you. Oh my goodness. They taught me in the big house. No mercy, no prisoners. Calm down, buddy. Okay, well, let's not go, like, looking for fights, though, okay? Kind of been freaking me out since we got out of prison. <laughs> sorry, sorry, I'll try and tone it down. Keep the ocelot in the cage, you know? Just chill. Keep and it cool. Is Jesse, you're Jesse. I'm glad we Let's as a go to work. To of course it was we go. mandatory, but I sense that you wanted to come anyway. So thank you for understanding how important I am. What are you doing? No one permitted back here except fireworks, you mean, huh? Jeez, well, get back there then. Perfect. Thank you. Now we can get to our jobs that we're totally qualified to do. <laughs> I promise. We're fireworks people. That's what we do. Well, good luck with your fireworking. Firework working? Uh, unimportant. I'll grab a bucket from the house. Be right back. Go, Radar, go. We need to nab as many fireworks as possible. Please be some in here. And they're not in here. There's no fireworks. Just stuff. Come what? On. Who plans a convention with no fireworks? Uh, why can't it ever be easy? <laughs> Please. When has it ever been easy? Easy or True. not, I can't help but notice that we still don't have any fireworks. Sugar cane? I guess we'll just need to make some. Oh no, I can't imagine to make fireworks. There has to be enough to some paper around here. Then... All we need is gunpowder and a fireworks star. Oh, that would really add some flash. We'll keep a lookout on the exits and stage. Well, there are the fireworks stars. I just said literally just now that I don't know how to make fireworks. And they just explained the whole thing. Wait. Okay, at least it looks like the fireworks union guys are. Did you see Evil the there? Stars. Evil Which was on the side. I take? All right. What color should we go for? We've got um, orange, green. Blue or magenta, which is burst, star, orange ball, or green creeper. I think green creeper is just going to be the most interesting, so I'm going to go for green. Normally, oh, I would do blue. Makes the firework shape like a green creeper face. Exactly. But um, the blue one's kind of boring. See, look, why is Evil here? Are you okay, buddy? <laughs> what are you doing? Ivor? Shh. I'm in stealth mode. Completely undetectable to the human eye. How? Invisibility potions. You'll have to take my word for it. Wait, you had invisibility potions this whole time? <laughs> yes, but ninja law says you must wait for the most dramatic time to use them. What? Why? I don't know. I'm not a ninja lawyer. Do you <laughs> have any more? More what? Invisibility potions. Uh, nope. Sadly, I drank my last one to surprise you here. But I'll be watching you. 
from the shadows. That is such a random, <laughs> random part of the story. Eivor turned into a ninja. Man, and he's still not being helpful at all because he had the invisibility potions the whole time and didn't actually tell us. Phenomenal work. We have the stage wall to look at. Do we want to poke the creeper though? I don't think we do. We want to punch the sugar canes definitely because that'll give us paper. Ooh, sugar cane. And then we just need um then we just need the creeper to die. Not explode though. We don't want him to explode. Let's go this way. Look at. We don't want to poke him that much. Guess that's part of the show. Admin me has taste in after speech entertainment. Yeah, not really any fireworks. Just poke him, see what happens. Oh, this okay. Is stupid. Dude. Gunpowder. Perfect. That could have been amazing. It didn't say poke with sword. It just kind of said poke, so I was a little bit worried. Uh, do we want to talk to these guys? I don't really know. How or do we just want to carry on? Coming? Oh, they're coming. This place is just kind of messy. Well, just be like the noble light of truth and shine through the darkness of the mess. Only then will you scatter the shadows and reveal your goal. Deep. Yeah, I'll work on that. Good to hear, <laughs> friend. I'll keep on keeping an eye out. We're actually pretty done. I don't want to waste too much time just in case uh, someone comes. I don't think there's going to be anything in here. No? Dirt! Yes! We're good. Right, uh, let's go. I don't think we need anything else. I'm worried that I might miss something that will be helpful later on. Let's just open the chest just in case. Because you never know. Huh. A copy of Lucas's book. Whoever owns this chest must be a fan. What? Oh, that's weird. So we've seen the ocelot, um, the ocelot head and also Lucas's book. I wonder if that has anything to do with the story. That would be really, really odd and hey, annoying because I kind of liked Lucas and I think he kind of helped us out a little bit. So it would be really annoying if he ended up being an absolute punk, wouldn't it? All right, let's create paper. Do we need to do more paper as well? Three paper. I can't even remember how to make a, um, a firework. Paper, sugar. Firework rocket is just one paper. How many do we need though? We've only got one firework star. Let's just do this. See what it does. Create. I think we need two. Now there's a firework. Nice. That's massive. <laughs> now just need to. Hey, Glenn. Uh oh. Wait a minute. You ain't Glenn. Yeah, I'm Glenn. And you ain't. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I'm sorry. I know you wanted me to tone it down, but I didn't know what else to do. Good job, buddy. I kind of panicked. I just wanted you to be safe. God, just maybe try not to hit them so hard next time, okay? Ugh, that was brutal. <laughs> that was awesome. Noted. Good job, Radar. That was actually I pretty sweet. The work of prison radar. <laughs> yes. Maybe. Did you get the bucket? Oh, I got the bucket. Yeah, buddy. Okay, we have bucket. We have. What should I do about this guy? Yeah, good point. Just we have get him Elytra. Out of the way, okay, like tuck him away somewhere. Roger. And we also have fireworks, so we're doing pretty good. Thanks, Radar. There's fake me. Or fake Jesse, even. Here we go. I wonder what the finale is going to be. All strapped in. Fireworks ready. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Why? Why did you make it so obvious? Jesse, we want to talk to you more about how great it is being your friend. He's, you know, something's up. We got to go now. Just go. Do it. Light him. Light him up. Q. Yes. There's the fireworks. The creeper face as well. And we're out of here. <laughs> That's pretty cool. That's actually a legit Minecraft strategy as well. You can use the fireworks to make your Elytra fly faster. Whoa, Very cool. Whoa, hey, hey, hey. Uh oh. Got it. What's going on? What are you doing? <laughs> Coming in hot. Ooh, the burns. Got it. Well, I just need to. 
Oh no. Oh, perfect. Just what I needed. Careful. Ah, oh, slow, don't Johnny. fall off. Come at me, ugly. Oh, jeez. Smack him. Oh, it actually hurt him. I didn't think that was gonna actually gonna work. Uh-oh. <laughs> Bye. Oh, that was close. Okay, time to get the others. Ah, yes. Right, let's poo the uh let's poo. Let's put <laughs> the water down there. Let's not poo. That'd be terrible. This is gonna be really obvious though. And that's a pretty amazing building. I wonder what's at the top. Maybe a theme park. That would be good. Boy, was I glad to see that waterfall. Yeah, fist pump. Yeah. Fist pumps all We're around. Getting kind of nervous down there. Sorry, fist pump to you. The welcoming committee was a little strict. Come on, let's get inside. All right, radar's hiding a body. <laughs> Not a dead body, hopefully, just uh, somebody knocked out. Uh, let's see what's inside this tower. I'm actually pretty excited that we can use the um, the hashtag potato four five one. I think it is. Okay. But I feel like there's going to be some baddies in here first. Freaky, right? This place is dead. Definitely strange. Though I imagine you might be relieved to have a little quiet right now, huh? Don't. I was almost expecting, I don't know, another huge boss battle or something when we got in here. Same. Yeah, the admin definitely seems to like those. But nothing. Nah, it's kind of hard to relax when you're in the middle of infiltrating a humongous tower. Owned by a deadly madman as you try to find his office and take away his powers. That's yeah. Fair. That's true. <laughs> Something weird's gonna happen, guys. I'm calling it now. Okay. What on earth is this? What are in those cubes? Nether bricks? It's so eerie. Oh, yeah, there's definitely people here. Ninjas? Oh no, we're about to get jumped. Yeah, there they are, look. Wait, no, hold on. That's that's the person from before. Look who it is. What? <laughs> Come out and play. <laughs> What's happening? Uh, hey guys, what's going on? Stand down, Ocelots. I told Lucas. you! Looks like the tables have finally turned, huh, Jesse? We can't let you keep doing what you're doing. That's enough now. Whoa, sorry. Guys, I'm so Lucas, confused. I think you're confused. It's me. Oh, we're not confused. We know exactly who you are. Now, hang on, everyone. No. It's our turn to talk. Not yours. Not anymore. I reformed the Ocelots because I wanted to remind everyone of how things were before. And most of all, I wanted to remind you. No, Because but... the Jesse I know wouldn't be running around on some power trip locking people up. Lucas. So yeah, I set your prisoners free. What are you gonna do about it? Yeah, and telling us our builds were ugly. Lucas, would you please stop talking for two seconds and just let me explain? Huh. And there is the new Jesse I've gotten to know lately. Everything you think I've told you since I came back from the Ice Palace was a lie. The admin locked me in a prison underground, took my identity, came back here, and pretended to be me. That is... No. How do we know this isn't a trick? No trick, friend. And it's not the first time. My friend Voss... The admin did the same thing with him. Yeah, we saw the whole thing. Is this really true? All those horrible things you did that... Let's get real huggy up in here. Okay. <laughs> yeah. It's you. <laughs> I thought he well, turned evil for a that sec. Have that sorted out. What in the world are we gonna do next? Wait, why are you even in here? We're trying to get to something called the terminal. We have a word of passage. <laughs> Potato. That we can apparently use to take away the admin's powers for good. Yeah, a lot of that was way over my head, especially the potato, but <laughs> I'm in. You just lead the way, and the new ocelots will have your back. Yay, hey, okay. That was a disaster averted. We now have a massive army. This. Romeo's quite the Jesse memorabilia collector. 
know we don't have much time, but it might be smart to suit up properly. Agreed. Oh, do we get to choose again? Oh my goodness, there's so many dudes. Um, what, what have we got? We got Redstone Riot, Golden Goliath, Ender Defender, Star Shield, Shield of Infinity, Admantium Impervium. That's pretty crazy. Eligard's Armor, Tim's Armor, Sword Breaker, or Dragon's Bane. Now, I think last time, a lot of you guys wanted me to choose Dragon's Bane when we got to choose armor. So, I'm going to choose it this time. Oh, I'm kind of like, I really want to use Tim's Armor, but I know we've used that before. Uh, there's no pink variety. I'm going to go for Dragon's Bane. Let's go. Let's, Let's do this. Let's do this, Dragon's Bane. You're copying me, buddy. It's good that we have an army now, though. I chose now, a good one. You look like you're ready for a showdown. Let's go. Oh, thanks, guys. Time to end this. Ocelots! Oh! <laughs> That's the worst, like, to battle thing ever. Oh! Dude, we're getting close already. I don't know if you can see it, but the achievements are uh, already saying like. five out of four. Four out of five, even. Why, hello there. Wasn't expecting you. Showdown. Oh, it's about to happen. What's the move here, Jesse? Maybe you're confused, but this is my office. Hang on, let me try and reason with him. Uh, hello, Jesse? It's over, admin. We're here to... Excuse me, excuse me, we? What? what? Where are they? Where'd they go? Oh, I am so upset that you're back. That wannabe ninja Ivor told me you were still in the Sunshine Institute. He did. Hearing that made me feel great. This? You got played. This makes me feel... Ugh, bad. It's called a hustle, admin. And you fell for it. Hook, line, and sinker. What better way to sneak back into Beacon Town right under your... Uh, my nose. Oh, you smug, arrogant, insignificant. What, pray tell, are you hoping to accomplish by challenging me? I don't know if you've noticed, but I'm just a touch more powerful than you. I know. That's why I'm not here to fight you. I want to talk this over. Jesse, uh, Jesse. Ugh, talking it out? What's the point in that? That's what losers do. <laughs> Real people, awesome people, settle their differences with... with... No, you're not doing any talking right now. Right now, you're just gonna shut up and listen. Nah, -uh, you don't tell me what to do. That's not how this works. Bro, this is getting intense. Oh, here we go. He's back to normal. Well, you know what? It's just as well you're back. Because being Jesse is the worst! Wow. Oh, yes! Yes, I said it! I hate being you! Your, your people, your <laughs> friends, they're so needy, so clingy! I have to listen to their stupid voices day after day after day, just asking for things. I, mean, I, I thought being Jesse meant that people would do what I wanted to do. No one ever asks what I want! Ah, it's all, can I have iron and can I have gold? That's what being a leader is, Romeo. It's not all fun and bossing people around. Sometimes it's hard. <sighs> yes, well, it's terribly disappointing is what it is. Good. <laughs> it's just, it was fun at first. I show them some super amazing display of my awesome powers. They'd laugh, I'd laugh. But soon they were just... Asking me to do that all the time. <laughs> you, know, you know what's funny? You've made me see something. I mean, it's starting to feel like maybe I should just leave being Jesse to you. What? You know? <laughs> the, the genuine article. What's your angle here? This is a trick, right? Nope. No tricks, no angles, no games. Just good old Romeo telling it like it is. What? <sighs> well, this has all been terribly enlightening, and I, I think we've all learned some great lessons here. Push him off. That I will totally remember for next time. Push him off! Next time? Yeah, the, the next world I build after I bedrock over yours. Oh, I'm going to get it totally right with that one. No! Whoa, he's... A whole new set of people. A whole new world. Oh, I'll be a great leader, a great friend next time around. I should thank you for all these 
These wonderful little lessons you've helped me to learn. There is no way I'm letting you do this. Oh. Well, you don't really have much of a choice, do you? <laughs> Sorry. But it's time to start fresh. Make a new world. He's going to bedrock over our town, to dude. Lose. That's mad. Oh, no. What oh, is that? This doesn't seem good. Oh, you guys are okay. Yeah. He just blipped us back to the hallways again. <laughs> he could have blipped them Such anywhere. A... Such a jerk. Yep. Could have just pushed him off, though. I mean, he can't fly, but... <laughs> so I guess that wouldn't work, but hey. <laughs> oh, dude, he's actually building it already. He's just like, you know what? Delete. Delete the whole thing. Eternal darkness is happening again. We're going to the underground. This is not good. This is really not good. Because, like, how do we get... How do we get above bedrock again? There's, like, no way. I don't know how to stop this. How are we going to stop this? We need I don't to know. take his powers away. Find the terminal space. Oh, yes, potato. The roof. That's where the admin keeps his portal to the terminal thing. Go. Come on. Ah. We need to get to that portal before the bedrock closes up. Let's do this. The epic music is starting. Guys, are you ready for a finale? Because I am. Let's go. Quick, go. Go, go, go. 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 Yes. Oh, no. <laughs> Go. Keep going. Stay safe, okay? Hey, that's what I was going to say to you. Oh. Why does Lucas... No telling what's through here, so be safe. Always get left behind. Always. Here we go. Through the portal. Just run. Just jump. Don't even stop. Just go. There we go. Get in, Jesse. Just please. No dramatic pauses, please. Here we go. If only that's what nether portal actually looked like, that would have been pretty sweet. I'm so ready. I'm glad I chose this armor. It kind of matches the surroundings. We made it. We're here. Yeah, but we don't know where here is. This is cool. Is this the end? Kind of looks endy. Whoa, check this out. This is cool. If only there were dimensions like this in Minecraft, that'd be so good. Is that the clock from the admin's tower? Random. <clears throat> I mean, uh, I uh, found the Colossus. <laughs> the trip down memory lane is nice and all, but how do we find the primary terminal thingy? Um... There is so much stuff in here. Uh, well, it's the admin's place, right? So what would he do? He'd probably know where he was going, so... <laughs> Protocol initiated. It's him! Oh, it's just more of his stupid recordings. You've selected admin protocol. Oh, it's like an automatic assistant or something. Weird. Like Siri. Welcome to Terminal Space. Nice. That's cool, man. <laughs> the admins are punk, but that is a cool base. Well, shall we? It looks like kind of like a, a testing ground for all his builds. Because so we've got the uh, the clock, and we've also got the, the big totem golem thingy as well. Only he ever comes here? The automated personal assistant system was developed to aid the mighty admin in menial tasks and help his friends navigate the terminal space. Okay. Man, so when he first made all this, he was still hoping his friends would come here too. Kinda this is mad. Makes me feel bad for him, actually. Nobody ever said it was easy to hang on to your friends. Look, this is the thing that they tried to kill. Um, they tried to kill. What's his name in? Why have I forgotten his name? You know, the nerdy guy. They tried to kill him with that. It's making me walk really, really slow, though. Radar. That's his name. It is like a testing ground. Because the, the ghast was there too. The black ghast with the red eyes. And the three heads. That was there too. So that's where he kind of builds all his ideas. Just kind of like his own personal world. Which is pretty awesome. Like is a testing that... world. Whoa. 
Oh, there's a code. Oh, I think I know what's gonna happen. I know how to unlock this. We got this, get ready. I... That was all over my head. Password, password, password. That must be the word of passage. Hashtag potato 451. Here we go. So we can put the potato in here, right? Guess we need to put something in there to get this thing going. Potato, potato. It's empty? What? Waiting for material request. I mean, it must be talking about the potato, right? Sounds right to me. Uh, potato, please? Acquiring potatoes. <laughs> what? Dispensed. Thank you. It's like a vending machine you talk to. That would be amazing in real life. Like a vending machine, you could just be like, Two potatoes? Give me some sweets. And it just yeah, dispenses. A normal one and a poisoned one. Which one do we use? I mean, the word of passage didn't say anything about poison, but it did have that weird hashtag thingy. That might mean something. Oh, I don't think that symbol ever actually means anything. Yeah. Hmm. Gotta figure out which one is correct. Surely it has to be the normal one, right? Surely. Uh, let's place the normal one because I don't think the poison potato is gonna be any good. Let me place it. Let me let me place it, please. Why would it? There we go. <laughs> This is right. Potato. I still need to enter the rest of the word of passage. So is this four five this one? Right or not? Till I do. Right here we go. Uh, use. This is so hard to do. Um, wait, what? Four five one. Do we just have to remove all of them like this? Let's see. I don't know how this grid works otherwise. Hmm. Don't think that's exactly right. Oh no. Um place poisoned one. Let's try this one. I still need to enter the rest of the word of passage. Won't know if this is right or not till I do. Oh no. Uh Grid, look huh, at what is this thing? Do I have to make a hashtag? Now what does it have to do with potato four five one? We got four, five, one, but I think we, let me put this stuff back. Here we go. Can you make a hashtag out of this by using one and four? I don't know. How do I do that? Make a hashtag. What out of all of this though? I don't know how to make a hashtag out of all of this. That's crazy. Four, five, one. I'm trying to figure out. I have no idea. Do it in the right order. Four, five, one. Tick. Hmm. Don't think that's exactly right. I'm going to try to run a hashtag. I don't know how you do it with all of this, though. This is going to get me stuck for ages. Prepare, guys. We're, we're in for the long haul. But if it's not... By doing it with 451, a hashtag is like... I don't even know how you make a hashtag out of this. You can remove this. Because it's only three wide. Only write 451. I don't know if you can write that either. You have to do it straight. That's so weird though. Like this? <laughs> Don't think that's exactly right. Number of blocks, 451. I have no idea what you guys are talking about. From left to right. What do you mean? How do I... Let me reset it. Let me reset it real quick. So you do left to right, 451. Maybe do it fourth down, fifth down, first. Wow, there's so many people... Going through this. Okay, here we go. Go back. I want to go back. Hmm. Don't think that's exactly right. So random. Let me change the potato though, because I don't think the poison potato is one. Maybe this will do the trick. Oh, I see what you mean now. I still need to enter the rest of the word of passage. I think I've got it. This is right or not? Till I do. Come on. 
So it's the opposite of what I've been doing. You don't take away the blocks, you leave the blocks. Oh, wait, that just... That just ticked something, didn't it? Something green in the middle one is right. Ah, I didn't see that at the top then. Dude, this is so confusing. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Four, five, one? So does that mean that the right-hand column is right? Oh, that says a one. I'm just straight up guessing now, guys. Five. So if I remove... Yeah, so these ones are right. It's just this one that isn't right. I'm just gonna have to guess. I have no idea. I can't even guess what this would be. So confused. Have you got any ideas, guys? Remove... It's definitely a pattern. Oh, I see. I think I've got it now. Yeah! I was confused by the numbers okay, on the okay, side. Sounds like I was looking at it in um, rows and not columns. That makes so much more sense. Thanks for your help, guys. Uh, I'm guessing that's not quite right. Agreed. Sorry, parrots. What? We just initiated a parrot party? Sounds good to me. Perfect. Okay, so that's right. We just need to put the poison potato in. And there we go. Here we go. Was that a good thud or a bad thud? It's Fred? Fred? Zara, hi. If you're seeing this recording, well, I guess the worst has happened. And you just put the word of passage into the primary terminal. I wish the terminal could just take away Romeo's admin powers. It'd be easier that way. But making this gauntlet was the best I could do. Oh. Put your hand into the pedestal to receive the gauntlet. It's got the power to make Romeo normal again. It might take a few hits to remove his powers entirely, but it'll get the job done. Do you understand? Sure. Then good luck, Sara. You're... I think you might need it. He's made like a golden gauntlet. It goes nothing. Here we go. This will be the second... Oh, okay. Uh-oh. What's Awkward. Happening? We're here to stop you, Romeo, once and for all. I Get told you, your world's done. No take that. Woo! Okay, they're alive. Quick, get the golden. Up. Get the golden up quick. Jesse, hurry! Don't waste the chance to get the golden gauntlet. Let's go. But yeah, this is the second gauntlet that Jesse's ever touched and had on his hand. What? Gauntlet delivered. Yo. Well, this should come in handy. Sweet. What have you done? Oh, five this out of five. Plan. Run directly at me. I'm gonna punch you in the face. Do it. Bam. He's gonna disappear, isn't he? Oh no, it works. We can actually smash him. I don't know what you're playing at, but it ends. Oh, he's clapping again. I said it ends now. Someone's overridden the what? system. What? Come on. Oh, you, you think you're very clever, don't you? Well, how about we finish this with a little change of scenery? Uh, what just happened? The Sea Temple? Kalu Kale, Jesse. Remember when we first met? He's playing mind games. That was back when I thought we could still be friends. Huh. Figures. This temple, this challenge, is my first gift to you. Whoa. Now, 
It's going to be where I bury you. Um. Rip. Rip. Oh my goodness. Big things happening. This is insane. Can you not just smack him with the gauntlet anyway? Try it. I think it worked. That's what I would have done. It did work. This gauntlet's amazing. I can still use the gauntlet. Die already? No. Smack him. <laughs> oh no. Q Q Q Q Q Q Q Q Q. Hey. This gauntlet is mad. It's absolutely magical. This is impossible. No one gets to make me <laughs> He's like glitching out. Why do I feel so powerless? This is pretty epic. Like really epic. Come on. I certainly hope you're enjoying this trip down memory lane as much as I am. You know what? The snowman was one of my favorite characters, actually. I liked him a lot. Are we in a boss fight? Oh, here we go. Hit the flames back. Okay, let's do this. Here we go. Slice! That was terrible. Jesse, what are you doing, buddy? Here we go. Here we go. Let's just fire one. Why can't I hit them back? Oh, I have to go closer. There's so many of them, though. Yeah! Haha! <laughs> Slice and dice, buddy. See, the snowman's the most powerful one. We're doing pretty good, though, I think. We have lost two hearts, but that's fine. Oh! Oh! What are you doing? Stop that. Stop that instantly. Jeez. Okay, we need to do this again. We need to get close and then hit them as quickly as possible. Now get to him and slice them. But he's getting up like every time. How do I get close? He's got a nice bow tie as well. I like it. Come on, let's do this. Here we go. Here we go. Nice, nice, nice. Slice. Get him. Come on. Yeah. We don't even need to slice him. We just need to smack him in the face with the gauntlet. Like the glitchiest snowman in the world. Oh, oh. Uh, you don't, don't touch me, touch me, touch me. Oh, Jesse. Petra? Oh, it's going back to this. <laughs> Aren't you happy to see me? Our friendship's gotten a little lucky on this adventure, hasn't it? Little worn thin. I wonder who did that. I'm not listening to you, admin. No? That's a shame. Here I thought it would be a nice way of working through some things. I don't think so. Let's just uh let's just chop you real nice. It's just like an old fashioned Minecraft jewel. Whoa, okay. Can I get him? I think I can get him. I just need to dodge when he lunges forward. That's not the real Petra though, so we're good. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Get him! Yes. It doesn't show how much health she has. Come on. Come on. There we go. This isn't so bad. This is much easier than the snowman. The snowman was more powerful than you. There we go. I don't know how many times we're going to have to hit her. But this is pretty easy. I can just slice her. She does some good dodges, but I got the dodges too, punk. We just need to keep punching her with the gauntlet, though, because otherwise it's not going to go well. Come on, finish it. Finish it! Come on. Come on. Come on! Bam! This is the big punch. Whoa. What just happened? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, this is... What is going on? Wait, please, please, stop. Don't take all my powers away. Without them, I don't know what I'd do. Uh you you can't take that from me. You I can't use your powers, Romeo. It's time you paid for everything you've done. You can't Don't forgive you him. Judge me. 
You don't get to judge me! Give me back uh, that No! That's the cause this. No! Uh, let's go! Dude, this guy is tripping. Badly. Why is he? He's just zapping us all over the place. He's looking pretty bad now, though. Uh-oh. It's gonna make us choose to forgive him, isn't it? It's over. You can say that again. How's that level playing field feel, huh, jerk? Get away from me! Well, he's still got some kind of abilities, though. He's, like, throwing rocks and stuff. Dude. What is he doing? Just throwing rocks. Okay, that's fair enough. We're just gonna come up and smack you square in the eyes, buddy. It's gonna be fine. It's over. Here we go. <laughs> Sock it to him, buddy. We got this. Here comes the music. Are you ready? If all he can do is throw rocks. I'd rather die than let you beat me. What? I am gonna destroy you. Oh jeez. No, 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 no. This is blowing my mind, guys. What is even going on? Come up. I, I can't even press it. I'm pressing it so hard. Yo, the flying, diving elbow. Quick, 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 quick. Quick. Grab it. Grab it. Ministry, this. Yeah. Kapow! <laughs> Dude, that was epic. Is he done? He looks like missing no from... Oh, look! It's the original guy. Why do you have to go and make everything so... Difficult. Everyone likes you. And you're nothing. Hey, we're not the ones trying to rule the world. What? No, no, I'm not. I just... I just wanted people to... People to... Uh-oh, jeez. Okay, I thought that was going to be the end. Defo not. Is the place falling down? This place is held together by my powers no more powers no more terminal zone <laughs> we're doomed we're gonna get uh -oh. buried if we don't get out of here pronto what about him what about him he's not our problem anymore but look at him he'll never make it out of here on his own oh she's right just just leave me my powers are the cause of all this in the first place don't make us choose, please. Please don't make us choose. I deserve to stay here and pay for the mess I made. I can't believe that, that this is what it took for me to realize. Oh. I never have had that kind of power in the first place. Look at where it got you. Yeah. Yeah, and it'll all be over soon. Oh my Jesse, goodness. We gotta go. Don't make me choose. Just leave him behind, please. Go on, leave me. Ah! Have to stay in this oblivion. Um. This place is falling apart. We can decide what happens to him later. Oh, let's just yeah, we can decide later. That's true. Not that's true. I'm gonna take him with me. I'm too to nice. Oh. Come on. Story is changing. Great. I hate it when it says that. <laughs> that either means you made a really good or a really bad decision. The lava gets to that portal before we do. We'll be stuck here forever. Let's awesome. Move. Let's go. Come on, Jesse. Come on, buddy. Go underneath. Good roll. You know what? <laughs> I'm glad I saved him just for that roll. That was amazing. I'm glad everyone said save him because uh, I, I didn't really want to do that. Jump, 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 jump. That's a four block jump, buddy. You can't do that in Minecraft. Or maybe five. I don't know. You definitely can't do five. <laughs> what is that? How can his... How can he still have powers? 
that are doing stuff to like these crazy golems as well. Dude. Did he just destroy the portal as well? We're done, so It's over. There must be something we can do. There must be. And we got the gauntlet still? I don't really know. Uh-oh. Oh, I think... Yeah, I was going to say. Now. Okay, he's just... He's sacrificing himself. Did he just get squished? I think he just got squished. <laughs> oh, man. This is intense. So intense. So the admin has got... Well, the admin has no powers anymore, so he's not an admin, but he's still someone. We're alive! We are alive! <sighs> yeah, and not a minute too soon. What about the be oh the bedrock's disappearing? I was gonna say, how are we gonna get rid of all that? <laughs> Come on, calm down, everyone. Calm down. You got this. It's gonna be okay. <laughs> They're freaking out. <laughs> what is he doing? Why is he the parrot lord? It's all too quiet, guys. Save the world again, huh? Doesn't that ever get old? Why, yes, thank you for noticing. Thought we'd fit in a light bit of world saving before afternoon pie time. Happy to see you all in one piece, too. I could go for and pie. What about the admin? Did, uh, did he not make it? Crazy as it seems, at the end, the admin sacrificed himself. Yeah. Romeo ended up saving all of us. Seriously? That doesn't sound like the admin to me. It was actually pretty noble. I tried to save him, bring him with us, but he didn't make it out. I feel better now. You Way are better. You still a good person for trying, Jesse. Well, I'm just glad that all of you are okay. And I guess, I guess this is all over? Yeah, yeah, I guess it is. Ready? What do you guys say we head home? I say way ahead of you, friend. <laughs> Me too. It seems too easy, guys. It seems too easy. I don't know what to feel right now. What is happening? They're rebuilding, which is good. Are they actually going to keep this? That would be quite cool. They, they didn't really need to build it, so they might as well. I like that the cow balloon is still there. I saw the whale balloon earlier as well, which was awesome. Looks like they're rebuilding it. There's classic Jesse. Jesse! Oh, for goodness sake. <laughs> I am approaching you from this direction, and am coming to speak with you. No ninja trickery, hijinks, or tomfoolery here. Yeah, I mean, I mean, you're right there. I can see you. I know, I know, but I'm trying not to sneak up on people anymore. <laughs> so, no more Ninja Ivor then? Ha! No, no. I decided it was time to stop running around in my pajamas and start trying to fix a few messes. Starting with trying to heal the rift between my old friends. Ah. Magnus is easy. We'll just pop by Boomtown. Oh man, that's awesome. They're gonna be so excited. You think so? That's certainly the way I'm hoping it will happen. Well, I suppose it's time for me to go. This has been fun, though, hasn't it? It has. Jesse! Jesse, hey! What's up, Radar? I was just saying goodbye to... He's gone. <laughs> Guess ninja habits die hard. I, uh, hope you don't mind. But uh, I've kind of been taking charge of the beautification project. I thought, why not at least make it look intentional? Really stepping it up to leader mode, if I do say so myself. True. And it's been stressful, but also fun. You've definitely been stepping it up. I'm really proud of you. Oh, wow. This is best day. <laughs> 
I just realized they put trees and stuff on it. That's cool. I like it. Whoa! <laughs> hey, Luna. No, Luna, what's Luna, good? Bad. That is the real Jesse. We don't like the real Jesse, remember? Really? Let's just ignore these losers and be on our way. Hmm. You understand? Stella, listen. I'm really sorry about what happened to. Don't even. If it wasn't for you and your little gang telling the admin off in the first place, I'd still have my home. You coming, sweetie? Say no. <laughs> Good girl. We're going to rebuild Champion City together, and it's going to be wonderful. Man, Stella is the absolute worst. Can't believe Luna went with Stella after everything. Although, I guess she did get left behind in the Sunshine Institute. True. Ugh, yeah, that's fair. Now, you got everything you need, all packed and double-checked? Yes, Jack. This is very, you know, bittersweet for me, you know. Goodbyes are no good. Hey. That we have, Dermy. So I won't say it this time. <laughs> Not to people that I will see again. <laughs> you got it. Come on, walk me to the gate. Oh, so she's going off in adventures. That's cool. So, you're leaving, apparently? For how long? Honestly, probably a while. But it's good this time. I'm doing it for me. I'm trying to, like, grow or whatever. Anyway, I'm about to say goodbye to everyone, and I <laughs> found here. I promised myself I wouldn't cry. Promise oh, broken. Jeez, it'll be okay. So Petra's heading off into the great unknown, huh? <laughs> I figured. It definitely sounds exciting. Everyone's got to find their happy place. For Petra, it's mostly in unexplored forests and caves. Yeah. I think I'm closing that chapter of my life for a while. It's time to settle down. Here. Hey, you guys are missing out on prime group hug action. Yeah. <laughs> I think this is like the last time we'll all be together, do you? No. Well, maybe. I don't know. I mean, if Petra's leaving. Well, I mean, until the world needs saving again, that always seems to act as a nice reunion. Well, hopefully, hopefully not too soon, though. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm gonna get out of here before I. <laughs> too late. <laughs> Bye, guys. Be safe out there, okay? The safest. And when you finish that book of yours, I better have a great part in it. Uh-huh. <laughs> Back in the admin's cabin, I, I know you promised that we'd always stick together. But the invite's still open if you want it. No pressure. What to go with her? Wait, you're leaving? Am I? Ah, oh, I thought it was just gonna be a peaceful end, and now it's gonna make me choose an ending. Ah, what are the two choices? Stay in Beacon Town or head on adventures? You know what? I feel like this is setting up for. Um, I think this is setting up for. Oh, I don't know. For him to just take over, for Radar to just be a leader. So, I I don't know. Dude, I really don't know what to do. I'm going to leave this up to you guys. What do you want to do? I'm going to go... <laughs> Jetra is happening. That's so funny. Jesse and Petra. It could do. It's up to you. Do I go or do I stay? I Leave? Oh, my goodness. Loads of you are saying leave. Pick Petra. People like Jesse and Petra together. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna do it. It's up to you guys. I'm clicking it. Yeah, I think Let's go. We're gonna hit the road for a while. Huh. So oh. it's pretty awesome, right? Story is changing. Yeah, yeah I, mean, I mean, it does, but, but without you here... Told you. Radar. Things are peaceful now, but 
danger could still strike at any time. Who do you think, pal? You! Me? Really? Yeah. I hereby promote you from intern to hero in residence. Thanks, boss. This, uh, you have been, you are. What I'm trying to say is that I promise I'll make you proud. You already have. Hey, Everyone's so cute. Going to miss you, you know? And I'm going to miss them too. But if anyone ever really needs me, I'll be around. That's a cool ending. I like it. This is it, guys. This is what you wanted. The ship is happening. No regrets. No regrets. See, look, you can just come back anytime. It's not like I'm leaving forever. I can come back. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye, Jesse. Hey, dummy. You gonna wait up or what? It's happening. It's happening. I was kind of hoping you'd be interested in a race. Ha! Ah, you're on. Yeah. I think we chose the yeah we chose the the good ending, guys. We, well, they're they're both good endings. We saved the world, but I like the ending a lot. I'm glad you got me to chose that because I was I was close to staying. Really close. Is that it? Is that the end? I think it's the end. It's getting the stats. You and 49% decided to be by Petra's side no matter what. It's literally 50-50, guys. We chose the 51% though. So, um, wow. <laughs> yeah, that was close. Really close. It's like, it's such a hard choice. It's unreal. What other things did we choose? You and 50... All these choices are so close. You and 50% let him become the man in charge. 51% encourage Radar to be his own man. Are these all going to be really close? So close. I guess this is the day before it comes out. It actually comes out tomorrow. So I guess not loads of people have played it. But still, you and 49% wanted nothing to do with Stella. So she embraced her dark side. Oh, I didn't know that happened. So she could be really different. I didn't know that. That's really cool. Yeah, look, not many people played it, so all the choices are really close. Uh, we showed Zara that there was hope in the world. I think that was the right choice, really. Like a really good choice. Oh, 50-50 on took pity on Romeo and pulled him out of the void. I think his, um, his ending would have been the same no matter what. You led with empathy and protected your friends no matter the cost. See, I'm a nice guy. <laughs> and this game proves it. <laughs> what advice did you give Jack? Play it cool, okay? So yeah, everything's like 50-50. So I guess like no one's played this yet. So you can choose, what was that one before? Did you confront the admin? Oh yeah, cause you could just like attack him instead. I wonder what happened different then. And then 51%. So most people have chosen to leave so far. And that's it. There was... I'm actually pretty surprised. It didn't give you any kind of indication whatsoever whether there would be a season 3. Because before, there was obviously going to be a season 3. But this time, there, there's no indication whatsoever. None at all. And by another season... I mean, by season 3, I meant another season. Um, wow. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. We're done here. We're actually done here. Story mode season two. Almost said season three. Story mode season two is donezo. It was good. You know what? I'm glad it was like a way more positive ending because the ending to season one was really sad. Like crazy sad. We saved the world, but bad things happened. Poor, poor little pork chop. Oh man, Ruben, bless his soul. He was kind of in like the beginning of this anyway. But guys, that is going to be the end of this stream, this video, and this series so far. Of course, if they do release another season, I will be the first person on it as always. 
thanks for sharing this opportunity with me to play this game with you guys because I'm glad I was allowed to, I was able to involve you guys in all the choices and stuff like that. Especially that last one because that was a tough one. <laughs> but yeah, guys, let me switch back to my big old face. There we go. And I just want to thank you again for hanging out with me. We are only, uh, let me point to it, 10 thousand subscribers away from 17 million which is mad so if you're brand new to the channel we haven't subbed yet then please do hit that subscribe button that'd be greatly greatly appreciated leave a like if you enjoyed whether you're watching live or you're watching afterwards i hope you have enjoyed this it has been amazing and i will see you next time i don't know what will happen with this game i'm kind of hoping they make another one but it's also a very very nice end to this series so i don't know it's up to them, and you'll be the first to know whether it does. So, guys, thank you again so much for watching. You are the best. Have an amazing day, and goodbye! <laughs> See you later, guys. Bye!